Alright guys, welcome back to Jolly Kitchen with me. Today we are going to make Thai Karan Cupcakes. So what do we need for the cupcakes? Uh, we're going to need the cake flour today. Um, any brand would work. Just fine. And then some of the baking powder as well, just to help our cupcake really really soft and spongy. And the next step is very very easy. I am very new to baking so mind me if my explanation is not very clear or sound like an expert one I'm still learning okay and um, just to do a sifting mixing cake flour and the baking powder together grab an egg I got the ovale today, you got SP or cake emulsifier or any form of emulsifier for the cake will be fine. And then just add all the ingredients that we sift already, put in the stand mixer bowl here. At this point, um, I will add the sugar. Um, you can use icing sugar or the caster sugar, that's okay. And then just to add the ovale here. Also, follow by an egg. And we also add some water here as well. And the next step I'm going to do is to um, beat all the ingredients together until slightly is well combined at the low speed one minute okay one minute low speed until it's all combined then uh, we're going to beat at the high speed for eight minutes and just to make sure the next step you prepare is to fill up the, um, the steamer uh, about two-thirds of the steamer and uh, we're gonna use quite a lot of water today and once it's all eight minutes run out I'm going to turn it off and then I'm going to add the lime juice in here the lime juice is going to help and make the face really cracked open beautifully and then add the essence today um, I'm gonna do the Thai style so I'm gonna add jasmine and then we, you're going to mix at the low speed for another two minutes I'm going to split them evenly and today the theme for me is to make a miniature watermelon So today, the theme for me is to make a miniature uh, watermelon and I'm going to do two colors today, um, the red one and the yellow one. A kitchen hack today, I used um, the Ziploc bag. I found it is very convenient and so much more easier to deal with um, the piping bag. I'll just pour in there and then um, cut the corner and squeeze them into the paper cup. And now my water is boiling hot now. There should be no single drop of water on the surface of your cake. So it's bringing me to my next step. So the kitchen hack number two I use today is to wrap the tea towel um, on top uh, on the lid. So it's no water is going to drop onto the surface of a cake. There are a few important keys to successfully steam these uh, cotton cupcakes. 
your water must be boiling hot, steamy hot. And once you put um, the cupcake onto the steamer, ready to be steamed, close the lid, turn the heat down to low, set the timer between 10 to 12 minutes. So depend on the size of your paper cup. This is very important. Don't peek. So wait until it's finished. It should have the same result as you see on the screen right now. And the next step, repeat the same thing. Thai cotton cupcakes. It's great to couple with tea, hot chocolate, or coffee, morning tea, breakfast tea, afternoon tea. And I hope you like what you see. And if you are enjoying this content, be sure to like and subscribe and share. I hope to see you again next time. You are watching Jolly Kitchen with Kid. Bye now.